Hello everyone and welcome back to another video lesson for BizMates for Beginners. Today everyone, we are going to take a look at the expression come up short. Now, it's a good one, so let's find out what it means. But first, before we do that, let's do a quick review of last week's expression. Okay, everyone, so imagine I say, I just got three new contracts. I've been working really hard to get new customers, to get new clients, and I just got three of them. So, you are very impressed with my work, so what do you say? You've got five seconds, okay? Go! All right, and time is up. If you said, wow, Justin, you're on fire, then that's exactly right, and thank you for remembering last week's class. Okay, everyone, so moving on to come up short. This is what I sometimes hear. Okay, I'm talking to my colleague Taro and I'm asking him about his section's performance, okay? So I ask him, hey Taro, did you meet last month's target? And Taro, he says, unfortunately, we missed our target. Okay, so yeah, a simple answer. I think it's okay. The grammar is fine. It's easy to understand, but we can use a more natural expression, and that is, that's right. Unfortunately, we came up a bit short. Okay, so whenever you miss your target or you can't achieve your goal, you come up short, okay? And I added a bit here just to soften the expression a little. If you say, yeah, we came up short, you know, how short did you come? Did you miss your target by a lot? I don't know. Well, hopefully not. So in this case, if you add a bit, it means you just barely missed the target. So just a little bit more and you would have achieved your goal, okay? So maybe when your manager is asking you, uh, did you achieve your target? And you say, oh, we came up a bit short, then maybe he or she might not be as angry, all right? So yes, we don't want angry managers. All right, everyone, so pronunciation is fairly simple, okay? We came up a bit short. However, when native English speakers, uh, especially from North America or Canada, where I'm from, when we speak quickly, we do tend to chop off or drop these T's, okay? So it'll sound like we came up a bit short, okay? So those T's, get cut off, all right? So that's something to be aware of. All right, so please repeat after me, okay, everyone? We came up a bit short. Your turn. All right, good job, okay? Now, after my sentence, did you meet last month's target? Okay, all right, good job, everyone. So remember this for next week. Okay, so our bonus question for today is another way to say weak for alcohol. So if you're not good at drinking or if you drink a little bit and you start to get drunk very easily, then you are? All right, if you know the answer, leave it in the comments below. If you don't, you can find it in one of our previous videos. All right, so if you have some time, check it out. All right, everyone, so that is it for me this week. Thank you so much for watching. Enjoy your weekend, everyone, and I'll see you next Friday. Thank you. All right, thanks for watching the video, everyone. If you want to see more BizMates for Beginners videos, you can check out my previous video right here. And don't forget to watch my words and phrases videos right here. And if you need help with emails, email pics is right here. All right, so don't forget to click the subscribe button, like our videos, and we'll see you next time. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye.